Hey guys, and hello my pretties. How are you today? Yeah. Um, so I'm in a fairly good mood, I guess. I don't know, I worked all day. Uh, I want to keep reading, but I'm, I'm way too tired too. But look what I bought. Yeah. I caved, and I bought the Home Games trilogy. So I have all the books in hard copy. I have to go return my other copy to see if they'll take it back, just in case I'm not going to read it. Um, like, because I already have the I have the hard copy now. I don't. And this is the thing, like, I really honestly hate hard copies. Uh, I know that's weird, because you shouldn't really hate hard copies, because they're still a book. But, like, a hard copy, it's hard, it doesn't move when you try to, like, but, like, I want to, like, bend it, I want to be able to put it in my bag and let it just move, but it's, like, a solid brick, so you have to put it on the side, you can't have anything hit it or else it ruins it, I don't know, and I feel like this is such a beautiful, like, like, okay, so, normally books come with these stupid things, I'll show you, demonstrate it quickly for you guys, um, and I know, like, you can take them off and whatnot, and, like, that's the appeal of them, they'll take them off and they have something underneath, but I honestly hate these things. Like, this is what the book looks like. I think it looks ugly. Like, um, but, like, it has these paper that they, like, they cover the booking, like, the binding with. And I don't hate these things. They're a waste of paper. And it's hiding this beautiful cover. And just, like, look how beautiful this spine is. Like, that's beautiful. Like, I feel proud carrying this around. If I was carrying that one around, I'd be like, ugh, yeah, I'm reading this book, woo. Um, like, I don't mind it in a soft cover. I honestly don't. Like, I think soft covers are great, because, like, this is the one that I bought that's soft cover. I like it because it bends, it feels like people have read it, it looks, like, awesome. I don't even mind the cover art. Like, honestly, like, I don't mind it when it's on a paperback. Love cover art when it's on a paperback. Um, when it's on a hardcover, I think it looks ugly and tacky, and I'm so glad that they give you the sleeve to take off, because it's annoying, it crumples in the bag, gets ruined easily, it's stupid. <laughs> but it is smart, because then you can, like, take all of the backing and stuff like that off of it. Um, so yeah, I'm reading, so this is the first one, which was The Hunger Games. If you haven't read it, I suggest reading it, because it's super easy to read, super funny, um, super sad, so, it's so good, and you're just like, oh my goodness, why is this book awesome? Um, and I honestly thought I was going to hate it. I was like, oh, well, yeah, I'll read it just to see what it's like. I watched the movie and I was just like, this movie is pretty good. This is actually a good movie. And then I bought the book and I was just like, because I just, I need to know more. And it just came to life. It was so easy to read. Like, I could flip through it. I find that I love the movie just as much as I love the book. I'm going to read it again, probably, like, in the next couple months, just to, like, refresh my memory. Um, and as, like a second, like, edition in the book series. This is a really good one. Like, I really kind of like it. It's, like, again, easy to read, which is a big thing for me. If I can't, it's not easy to read. I hate, like, I can't do it. I am, like, it's so hard for me to focus just on everyday tasks. If it's a book I can't read, I'm not going to read it. So, easy to read. You get super good into the, into the characters. I'm going to be a big dork and say that I've got the biggest crush on Katniss and she's the main girl in the books. Um, I also have a main, like, a huge crush on the girl who plays her in the movies, because I think she's stunningly beautiful and hot. <laughs> I'm just like, take me home now, Pris. Just, can I live with you? It's just, I, we don't even, it doesn't even have to be sexual. Let me just beside you all the time. Just, nah. <laughs> Such a creep, and I know it. But um, on the note of going home with boys, <laughs> that sounds bad. I am going to be going to a gay bar soon. Um, I do it whenever, like once in a while. I'm not the biggest fan of them. I just don't like bars in general. I don't like clubs in general. I've kind of grown out of it, I guess. I don't know. I'm just like I'd like to go for like casual drinks on a patio with a friend, but going like getting dressed up to go to a club and being like it on and possibly not and dancing with the ladies I just it annoys me I'm just, eh, not into it I just it's okay um 
but we are going to be going to a ladies' night, I guess. But I'm going with a couple of my gay friends, and one of them is a guy, and so I'm super excited because he's hilarious, and I can't wait to just hang out with him all night, and just, yeah, just fuck around and just hang out. Um, probably won't stay there for long, to be perfectly honest. <clears throat> going with one of my best friends, so that's going to be cool because it's going to be us hitting the town again because we went to a couple places over the summer and it was okay like eh, had some issues this summer uh, or this past summer this was almost a year ago and yeah so excited but my thing is with lesbians for the most part because you've watched my vlogs I know you guys more or less know me and maybe you got like nature hey <laughs> and so most of the people who watch my videos have either known me for a while or know like what I'm like and stuff like that and so you know I'm not very pretentious I'm not very high up on myself like I'm very mellow easygoing and I hate pretentious lesbians like you go to the bars and they're like yeah I know exactly who I am I'm, I'm, I'm the coolest bitch and you're just like can you just get over yourself this is why I wear bangs cause like look at my forehead it's just like Wrinkle, 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 wrinkle. And like, so those ladies, so those ladies be all like, oh, oh my god, I'm amazing. Like, my views on life are so much better than everybody else's. And it just, I don't know, it just annoys me. So I don't like going out to bars because it's filled with lesbians like this. And they're so stupid all the time. And I'm just like, can you get over yourself, please? Just get over yourself and move on. That's all you have to do. So it's easy. It's really easy to do. Just do it. <laughs> so that's my little rant about lesbians today. Mmm, tired. I had a chai tea latte. Um, a sugar filled and I'm fairly sure they put coffee in their ice. Um passion tea uh drink from Starbucks and then a girl from my work pretty cool. Uh, she bought me an energy drink <laughs> before I left. And I was a little wired on the bus home. I was just like, oh, yeah, no worries. Thank you. Oh, thanks. You were reading over my shoulder? That's cool. You this book is awesome. So, <laughs> um, and by the time I got home, I felt so good. I was just like, oh, caffeine and Caitlin. Don't mix. Yeah. yeah. I did my nails. They are all red, except for these two, which are green. Look, they look really dark in this lighting. Can I... Did it work? Did it work? I don't know. It didn't work. Alright, but I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm gonna... No, I'm not going to read any more tonight. I'm going to actually just brush my teeth and pass out. I'm tired. I got this huge break out of pimples on the side. Do a bit. <sighs> Anyways, I'm going to with a really long video today because I haven't made a video in a while. I'm sorry. I should be making videos more often. Sorry. Can you forgive me? I took my glasses off. Can you forgive me? Is it weird? Glasses, yes. Glasses, no. Glasses, yes. I can actually see you and not just see a blurry camera. So, um, I don't, I feel like you guys look at me and I'm like, Wah. Ooh, crazy eyes. Okay. I love you guys, and I will see you soon. Hopefully tomorrow. Um, but I'm working tomorrow, and I have to go to a birthday party tomorrow, so... Maybe not, because I'm gonna go hang out with some friends. <laughs> maybe I'll make one in the morning, because then I can just be like, okay. Oh. But we'll see. And then I can show you my outfit for the day. See, I also like my straight across bangs, because... They hide, like, my five, my thing, my forehead. I have a huge forehead. I think I have a huge forehead. I probably don't. It probably looks proportionate to my face. But it's just weird because I normally have my bangs down or to the side or something. I'm making this longer. Okay, bye.